continues to try to put him to rest at Cleveland Memorial Garden Cemetery more than five years after he passed away. She's desperately looking to put this part of her life behind her, so she called the 19 troubleshooters. Colt Molesky has a story tonight. A Cleveland woman has family members buried right here, but finding them will be a challenge because she's still waiting on headstones that she tried to get years ago. That that wasn't right, what you did to me, and, and I'm still hurt behind that. Years of waiting to finish putting family members to rest. There's still no headstone. Like, who, like what I'm going to see, a pile of dirt? Antoinette Barfield buried her brother in 2018. She says she worked with this man, Kenny Bairden, who says he was representing funerals by Eric Williams. That he went to school with my brother, um, he knew him from the neighborhood, um, he would love to do his funeral. Bearfield says Bairden organized the funeral, even leading Bearfield to believe he was helping the family with some discounts. The trouble started when he returned, offering discounts on not just her brother's headstone, but her son's, who she recently lost, along with two other family members. He got me for 65. Barfield filled out a police report in 2019 for the $6,500 she lost, and she went to the funeral home. And they said that they knew he was up to something, but they couldn't figure out what he was up to. So I went to the funeral home and was asked to leave and call the company number. The person I talked with claims Baird never worked for them, adding this is a matter for the courts. So I called the police and was told the case has been sent to the grand jury. It was put before them days ago and awaits their decision. They just said they was going to reach back out to me and I, like, I, I've been waiting. Unfortunately, closure still eludes Barfield as she continues to wait for the headstones to finally put her family members to rest. In Cleveland, Colt Molesky, 19 News. The night.